What is up my old lanes? My name is Sean and this is Forza Horizon 2. I figured I'd give this one last hurrah before Forza Horizon 3 releases very soon. So as you can see, yeah, I'm just cruising around in my little Volkswagen Doom Beetle buggy thing. And as you can see, it is no slouch. However, this vehicle does have a secret weapon. As I will now show you after go away, shut up. <laughs> I am playing with an Xbox three or uh, Xbox One Elite controller, which has the little hair trigger switches on the back of it for the triggers. The hair trigger switch is activated, so it's basically limiting me to fifty percent throttle right now. So if I turn that off, I unleash all nearly nine hundred horsepower of the V eight I put in this thing. This is one of my Mad Max inspired builds. You know, off road tires, the rally tires, rally suspension, the brushed steel paint, so it looks like just raw metal. But I figured I'd have a go at making some Mad Max inspired cars in Horizon 2, and this, this thing is kind of hard to control because it's got 880 horsepower or something like that. Yeah, hitting 880 horsepower there on the telemetry. So it, it's got some power because I put the big, I think the 6.2 liter V8 in it. Uh, let's head back to one of the hubs. If, if I can drive this thing straight, might have to limit my power again. <laughs> um, let's check out some of the other Mad Max builds as well as a few other cars that I have. Because I have... Uh, I have quite a few cars in this game. What can I do to help you? Here we are, back in the garage. We can uh, skim through some of my, uh, like, 300 or so cars that I own on this game. It, it's quite an impressive roster. I got a pretty good lineup of cars available. Got Errol Adams, got Austin Martins, freaking Audi station wagons. Rally cars, Super GTs, everything. But, let's see if I can find one of my other Mad Max builds. There's a dirty old Camaro that needs to be Mad Maxified. Oh, here's another one. This is one of my favorite Mad Max cars. See, like the Beetle, and went with the brushed steel. So it just looks like the raw metal body. We got some chrome plating on there. The chrome mirrors, shining chrome, big hood scoop, the big V8. This one is pushing about 760 horsepower, not quite as much as the Beetle, and it's heavier, so it is a bit easier to manage all that power. Rally tires, rally suspension, stock width on the front, but big old fat, I think, 345s on the rear. So it's fun. It's definitely a fun car to drive. And it's raining. Wonder, ooh, a Hummer. Let's race the Hummer. This is going to be too easy. D360. This thing is maxed out A class, so this is going to be easy. Because the Hummer is slow. It's kind of hard to put all my power down. Because the roads are wet, and I got 730 of it. But we, we can manage. We got... Ah! Stupid Jeep. I'm... Ow. I, I have damage turned off right now. Normally I do have it turned on fully when I'm doing actual race events, but I'll turn it off when I'm just cruising. This game is epic fun to just cruise around. Big ol' hood scoop just sitting there in the way. This thing does go pretty damn fast. Although I've gotten that beetle up to 200, so the beetle is technically faster. I don't, oh, look, there's another beetle there. And a jeep. That was way too easy. Let's find someone a bit harder to race. Oh, I got him. <laughs> 
Eight eight hundred. All right. So his PI is on par with what I have, but he is also a lot heavier than me. So I should have the advantage in handling. Not that this thing actually handles very well. Looks like I do have an advantage of speed, though. That's good. Watch out, Land Rover! Ah! This thing doesn't particularly handle well. I have worse handling cars, to be honest. Like, well, that, that Doom Beetle. But, you know, that's kind of a theme with my Mad Max builds. They have lots of power, but are particularly built for corners. See, even the AI crashed into the building. Ooh, this will be a fun one. S1 O. I might have to use my offer abilities to my advantage. And it's mostly straight path on all paper. Crap. <laughs> this is not good for me, unless I can cut through there somehow without killing myself. Yep, that's it. We're taking a shortcut. Because that thing's faster than I am, so I pretty much have to. Oh, man. This is actually going to be pretty close, even with my shortcut. And I got it. Yes! I am victorious! <laughs> but, yeah, you can, you can see the bonkersness of these Mad Max cars. It's just lots of power, and who cares about handling? Just all the power. We're back with another Mad Max car! This is a Pontiac Trans Am. I love to stock it on this one, because it's got the cool little shaker at the scoop. And a cheeky PlayStation logo on there. And a license plate! Sweet. Shut up, Anna. I don't want to go anywhere. This one is pushing a bit more power than the Camaro. This one's uh, pushing about 850 horsepower. So a little bit more on line with what we were getting out of the uh, Volkswagen. It doesn't necessarily feel faster. It's actually fairly easy to drive, despite all that power. I mean, as easy as a Mad Max themed build is. I say it's easy to drive, and I just immediately spin out. Wonderful. Where are we going? This just goes to nowhere, doesn't it? There's another trail off that way. Maybe I'll find another billboard, smashboard thing up here. Where the hell am I? Oh! Look at these ruins. That's cool. Oops, I broke it. I got myself stuck. I'm stuck. Wow. Nice view from up here. Look at that. There's some balloons. There's a town down there. There's something over there. I have freed myself. Alright. I've been here once before because it was one of the bucket list challenges is around here, but I haven't like thoroughly explored this area. This is cool. What? How the hell have I ended up on the golf course? I got completely turned around. Like I had no idea I was anywhere near here. Sweet flips. Ow! Why are you running into me? Uh, nope, 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 nope. Let me just smash this guy up a bit. That, uh... <laughs> that bucket list challenge with this car is a pain in the ass. I got done though, eventually, but yeah, it's a pain in the ass. It's really hard. Now for something completely mental! 
I know it doesn't particularly look all that mental, you know, apart from the fact that I'm driving an open top convertible in the rain. But, uh, yeah! We got a four rotor in this thing! And four wheel drive! Rally suspension! Yeah, this thing is just absurdly mental, but I love it. I love the, menta the mentality of it. The mentalness. Mentalism. Whatever the proper word for that would be, but I can't drive this thing straight ever. This thing is fully built, it's like it's S2. It, it will keep up with like McLarens and shit. It's ridiculous. <laughs> No! But this is the kind of mental thing that this game lets you do. And I love it. You know, put a four rotor racing engine in a Miata, convert it to four wheel drive, the rally tires. Now this car does normally handle really, really well. It's just got way too much horsepower. <laughs> it's not meant to have more than like 200 horsepower. So I put over 700 in it. <laughs> There's another Miata. He's got a roof though. Should watch where I'm going. Again. Anyway, so what I think I'm going to do now is one of the, uh, the showcase events. There's one somewhere around this way. Oh crap. See, I can't control this car. It's got too much power. I'm really tempted to race that Viper. Let's do it. I actually have a higher FBI rating in this car just because it's so light but so powerful. Ah, he's trying to ram me off the road because he's bigger than I am. The bully. That was good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes! Here's one of the showcase events. I'm going to finish off this video with the showcase event. Because these are fun and crazy and over the top. And Horizon 3 is supposed to deliver even more. So. Still raining. Awesome. Beat the cargo plane. That's right. I'm in a Jaguar, and I'm racing an airplane. That airplane. That's a big airplane. Just remember, you both have to hit all the same points, and the turning circle on that thing is huge. Yeah. Let's do this. See ya. No. No. Gotta modulate my throttle. I don't just spin out of control. I'm coming for you, airplane. I'm winning this race. The lack of ABS. I love the way everything shakes when it flies over. Especially the one where I get to race the fighter jets. That one's fun. There's the checkpoint. I need to drive faster. I'm going too slow. I know I can drive faster than this. There we go. Let's see. Where is it? It's up there somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Oh, that was. Getting uh, a little slippery there. Oh, I'm actually getting up to the airplane. Yes. Yes. Oh, right underneath the airplane.
I gotta be careful about going through the grass. I'm not quite so fast in the grass. That turn pretty bad. Uh, <laughs> oh boy, dirt roads, fun. Dirt roads in the rain, extra. Oh, that's fun. That's fun. Ow. Yeah, I'm gonna just see, rewind this for a bit. I'm normally like really good on dirt roads. For some reason, for some reason this car don't like it. That was much better. Yeah. I'm gonna end this turn. Trying to like commentate myself on driving isn't particularly easy. I don't know how Fire Race does it. But uh well he's been doing this kind of stuff for years. So he's got a lot more practice than me. Alright. Next up is the runway. Awesome. We're going on to the airport. Oh crap. I'm falling behind. Not good. I need to go faster. I'm catching him. Because he's slowing down. Yes. 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 I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Yes. <laughs> that was that was actually pretty close. I have to admit, it was fun though. I didn't think you had a chance in this one. You were like a man possessed <laughs> chasing him down. Okay, whatever. I'm going to accept my victory, and I'm going to end this here. So long, my Oatlings. Until next time, hit that like button if you liked this video. Hit the dislike button if you disliked it. Goodbye.